welcome students today we will study a very interesting and a very simple mnemonic so that you can be able to identify and differentiate between a myeloblast and a lymphoblast so let's start with the class see this is cell labeled as a and this is cell labeled as b cell labeled as a is a myeloblast right whereas cell labeled as b is a lymphoblast so how will you identify the cell student yes if you diagnose a patient as acute leukemia what is the definition of acute leukemia according to who criteria yes when more than 20% blast you identify the case as a case of acute leukemia but now you have to identify whether it is aml or aln right whether they are myeloblast or lymphoblast so let me tell you students the best test in order to differentiate between a myeloblast and a lymphoblast is immunophenotyping it is immunophenotyping but at least there are certain features yes that can help you identify and differentiate between these two cells on peripheral blood film as well as on the bone marrow aspiration so let me tell you these few differences okay so i have made a very simple mnemonic for you right we will see M for myeloblast, M for mole, right? M for myeloblast, M for mole. That means more in size, larger size cell. A cell which is larger, right, is a myeloblast. More amount of cytoplasm, M for myeloblast, M for more amount of cytoplasm. More number of nucleoli, three to five nucleoli usually in a myeloblast. And lymphoblast only one to two or very inconspicuous nucleoli. Next is presence of R rods in a myeloblast. So R rods, if present in your case, then you can easily identify the cell as a myeloblast. Whereas R rods are not present in a case of a lymphoblast. Next is M for more and M for granules. So more granules, or I can say the granular cytoplasm is a feature of myeloblast. Whereas in a lymphoblast, very thin rim. and cytoplasm is there and that too is a granular cytoplasm next is myeloblast has got a finer chromatin whereas lymphoblast has got a coarser chromatin now students this is difficult to differentiate and identify the type of chromatin finer or coarser and it takes experience but at least i will tell you these features and show you how can you differentiate between these different features on microscopy so yes i told you cell labeled as a is a myeloblast cell labeled as a is a myeloblast and cell labeled as b is a lymphoblast so what were the features m for more m for more in size so this is a larger size cell this is a larger size cell compared to a lymphoblast number 1 number 2 is more amount of cytoplasm you see this has got a more amount of cytoplasm compared to very thin rim scan cytoplasm and that to a granular cytoplasm in a lymphoblast next i told you the presence of nucleoli not very clearly visible in my case but i will tell you that myeloblast is characterized by 3 to 5 prominent nucleoli whereas lymphoblast has got inconspicuous or hardly 1 to 2 nucleoli next i told you the presence of out rods is a very very important feature you see these rod like structures yes if the out rods are present you can easily make a diagnosis of myeloblast and out rods will be completely absent in our lymphoblast so these are the important features last i told you yes that it can be difficult to differentiate to differentiate the chromatin yes can you identify this is finer chromatin in a myeloblast Yes, finer chromatin in a myeloblast compared to a lymphoblast. So myeloblast, do you see this slightly whitish, transparent, open type of chromatin compared to a lymphoblast, where clumping of chromatin has taken place? Or can I say this is coarser chromatin? So if you are a MBBS student, it may be difficult to identify and appreciate this. finer or denser chromatin it takes experience but at least on this image can you identify this is somewhat open transparent 
finer chromatin compared to clumping of chromatin which takes place in the lymphoblast yes so these are very simple features and a very very simple mnemonic yes m for my last m for everything more more in size it's a larger size cell more amount of cytoplasm more number of nucleoli more or presence of r dots would be present and the presence of finer chromatin whereas lymphoblast l for less less amount of cytoplasm less in size less number of nucleoli and no or rods so with the help of this simple mnemonic students i hope you will be able to identify these cells